Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. Today we will look into how to shoot an AR game object using a bullet which we spawn by touch. So basically what we will be doing is to scan a plane surface, then we get an indicator. On the first touch we spawn a prefab, where there will be multiple spiders. On, the fur on further touches we will destroy the spiders when tapped on the screen using spheres as bullet with a little explosion and that's it. There can be multiple situations where you might find this helpful. This project is an extension to my previous videos. I'll post the links in the description. And also try to attach relevant scripts. If you like my work, give it a thumbs up and subscribe. So let's go to Unity. As you see, this project is from the last week where we made the spider walk. But we are building a bullet shooting mechanism. So let's go to our old shooting by touch scene made a couple of weeks back. The link can be found for the video in the description or by pressing the i button on the top. Let's open the shoot AR object scene. Here we see a game object controller in the hierarchy. At the moment the joystick canvas field is empty. Let's replace it with the shoot script. Open the AR placement script we created earlier. Just edit the three lines the game object as shoot and subsequently game active false and true. Back to the editor. On the shoot script, let's open the script sitting on it. This script was written to touch and explode the spider. We'll replace this to make it such that you can spawn bullets to aim and shoot the spiders. So let's make this transform and we need its coordinates. Make the other game object the contain, to contain the projectiles or bullets or whatever you want. Here in the update method, remove all the conditions inside the if statement. Then instantiate the bullet as a game object which has the projectile and start from the AR camera position and rotation. Then ensuring that the bullet has got a rigid, rigid body and use add force in the forward direction and multiply by the shoot force factor. Add the variable shoot force to the top as well. I used 700 as this worked well during trials. Save your script. Back to the editor. In the AR camera field, drag the AR camera. Then for the projectile, we need to create a bullet. But before that, let's use the spider and duplicate to make more spiders in a scene. The more the better for shooting. So I'll add an empty game object to the hierarchy, reset it and call it spider parent. Then drag the spider under this new game object and duplicate a few spiders. These all are random. So I've got around 7 spiders which should be sufficient for today's demo. Let's also change the current walking animator to the idle one we had previously saved. Apply it to all the spiders. Drag the spider parent in the prefab folder and delete it from the scene. In the controller game object, replace the AR object to spawn field from the existing spider to this new prefab, spider prefab. Additionally, the shoot field with the shoot script game object. Save your scene then. Now for the projectile or bullet, the easiest thing to do is to right click in the hierarchy then 3D object, then add a sphere. I'll reset the transform values but also scale it to scale it down to 0.1 in all axes as the spiders are also small. Then add a rigid body component as we need to add force on it. Then perhaps add a script to the bullet so that we can collide. So when it collides with the spider, we need an explosion effect. 
The explosion package should be in the link below. So let's add a script and call it explode and open it up. You can call it something better of course. Wipe everything inside, then add game object explosion which will be spawned in the place of contact of the bullet and the spider. Then use a method of on collision enter and check if the collision happened with the tag of spider as you see the spider has a tag on it. If true then destroy the item uh, the sphere or your bullet collided with and immediately instantiate an explosion at the same place of collision. That's simple, isn't it? Back to the editor, add the explosion prefab to the sphere in the explode script and drag it to the prefab folder. Delete the sphere from the hierarchy. In the shoot script game object, on shoot script in the projectile empty field add this new sphere we created which should act as a bullet now double check everything and save scene go to build scenes add the scene mark it change the project name if you wish to and hit build and run save the apk somewhere and that's it done That's it. This is how we spawn all the spiders by the first touch, then destroy using a sphere as a bullet on the second and further touches. Let me know in the comment section if you wish to see something further than what we have done today. That's it for today. If you like my work, give it a thumbs up, subscribe as I'll be posting Unity related videos possibly every week and don't forget to hit the bell icon. Thank you and peace.